<clears throat> Hello guys, so today we're gonna be making a new series and it's gonna be about shooter games So I mainly did this because um, So look it's scratch tutorial and then we just go down and then Boom right there shooting games. So that's what we're gonna be working on today. So basically we are gonna make this move today All right, so we have a very simple script for this. It's when this is clicked forever if key right arrow or key D is pressed. So this way it will either do the W A S D or the arrows, which I I just I know a lot of people like that, you know. So basically we're gonna change the X by ten. So now if you see what this does, oh wow. So now we're just gonna duplicate this and we're gonna do the same for the left side and then we just change it by negative 10 so now he can move back and forth like this all right now we are gonna do another one and it's just gonna be up finally we're gonna do down so now if you see here we have all of the controls and he can move but that's not really what I was thinking we were gonna do this video because this this is pretty simple i i've i've done this in one of my projects before you know like in the gerald game you know that's how that's how i just usually make things move how are you supposed to aim the gun we could just go when this is clicked forever point towards mount mouse pointer and it would just it would do the trick for us right there so we might just want to you know So this way, yeah, you see how he points at the mouse pointer? <clears throat> we are going to make a bullet. So this is actually going to just be, well, I mean, I think it's, I think it's pretty self-explanatory what this is. So let's now call the code the bullet, all right? We're going to say when this is clicked forever, if mouse down, then we are going to create code of myself, all right? And then we're also just gonna say when this is clicked forever go to shooter and point towards mouse pointer all right and then finally we're gonna hide so this is all we're really gonna do with the bullet outside of the clone all right when I start as clone then we are going to show first of all we're going to show and then forever we're gonna repeat until touching the edge and we're just gonna move 20 steps and then once it's touching the edge it's going to delete this clone so now this is what it looks like that's what we have so far you know so what we're gonna do is we're gonna say if mouse down create clone myself and then wait until not mouse down so then it's only just gonna do it once for every time that we click so that is basically, that's really all I wanted to cover today. That, that's the essentials. That's like, like to, next time we're probably going to work on the enemy. So yeah, just stick around for that. If you want to see this, uh, subscribe to be a part of the Gerald Jogger and I'll see you next time. Bye.